For the CircuitPython Parsec today, I wanted to talk about using the Circuit Playground library to make it really, really easy to play tones on the Circuit Playground Bluefruit or the Circuit Playground Express. I can use, in CircuitPython, the Circuit Playground library to make stuff super easy and very consistent type of syntax. I'm going to reset, and you're going to hear it play some little tones. The way that works, I import the Circuit Playground library as CP, and then I use cp.playtone, and then I give it a frequency, in this case I'm giving it an A, uh, and the duration, in this case I'm giving it one second. And then this is followed by a B, a C, and a D. So that's that first little set of tones that plays. Now if I want to go ahead and use the buttons, this is where Circuit Playground uh, gets really nice and, and easy to teach or to learn. Uh, in this case, again, I import that library, and then if the cp.button A is true, which means that button has been pressed, then we're going to play a C. And again, I'll hold this up to my mic so you can hear it. Uh, so here we go, I'm gonna press the A button, and it plays the uh, C. If I press the B button, it plays a D. Uh, and then finally what I'll do is a version that instead of using play tone uses start tone and stop tone. So what those do is give you the ability to just play a tone forever until you say otherwise. So here I'm going to go ahead and resave this. You can see from Circuit Playground Library I'm importing CP while true, the main loop, if CP.button A is pressed then we're gonna start the tone, a 660, an E. It's gonna play that until I let go. Same sort of thing with button B, it'll play a G until I let go. Uh, and there you can see the else is stop tone, and that's what stops the tones from playing. So again, I'll hold this up, and you can hear that's just gonna play that forever and ever and ever. And then I'll press the other button until I let go. So that is how you can use start tone, stop tone, and play tone inside of the Circuit Playground library in Circuit Python in order to make some basic music. And that is your Circuit Python Parsec.